Hello Collective, this is Renee and welcome. Today I just wanted to do a Divine Masculine update because I feel a lot of energy in the Collective. And with this Masculine, I feel like they're looking at things from a different perspective. And taking a lot of time in solitude. I do feel like they're they're still trying to be social and kind of keep going through the same habits. But what I'm feeling like is those habits just aren't fulfilling anymore. Those habits that they're used to doing just aren't satisfying their need. And so I feel like that's that's leaving this masculine to really question if they need to make changes in their life to feel better about themselves. I feel like they just don't feel satisfied where they're at. And I feel like... The time when they felt most satisfied is when you were a bigger part of their life. And I think they're coming to the realization that you were a big factor in making them feel satisfied, right? And I'm really feeling like this masculine is really missing the nurturing feeling that you gave to them. They're really yearning for that feeling of the pure love that you gave to them, you know, that, that you surrounded yourself with. And you have a sort of energy that is just uncomparable and I feel like they're really feeling that you are someone who's very unique and this person is really trying to go through their healing and their spiritual team is kind of trying to push them or guide them in the right direction but your person is having a really hard time nurturing that healing. They're having a hard time connecting with that inner child that needs to be nurtured. And that's leaving them feeling like they're not capable. Right? Like, they're just having a hard time with this. So I feel like you're the divine masculine, their spiritual team, God, source, spirit is kind of pushing them to make a decision. I feel like it's going to be a push which end up being a tower moment. Something very unexpected happening that kind of makes them move in the direction they need to. And this can look like a breakup. This can look like some kind of unexpected event that they weren't prepared for. And I feel like spirit is moving them in the direction that they need to go through this event. And my divine feminine, I feel like there's there's issues surrounding your masculine that you can kind of feel. And I, I think that they're reflecting certain things to you that's making you dive deeper into your healing, into your um, self-awareness, into your spiritual journey even more as well. 
So pay attention to the things that you're thinking about because I feel like your masculine is mirroring those things back to you. Um, I feel like a, a lot of things, there's a lot of telepathy going on and you should be self-aware of feelings that are being mirrored to you. Okay. I feel like the masculine is being pressured into making certain changes. And this pressure is actually coming from the feeling of other people coming into your energy. I I think that the masculine is feeling intuitively that there are other people interested in you. There are other people, you know, seeing the same light that they did in you and being attracted to it. You know, you're a magnetic soul. You are someone that a lot of people are attracted to. They're attracted to your energy. Um, they're attracted to the vibrance of your aura. And I think this masculine is really paying attention to, you know, people that are coming in contact with you. And it's making them nervous. They feel like they need to make certain changes. They need to make certain steps or they're going to lose you to someone else because they know the type of person that you are. You're not a, the type of person to move from person to person. You are the type of person who will put in time and effort and really nurture and grow a relationship. So I feel like this masculine really feels like you know, the next relationship that you have that's not with them, they could lose you for good. So I I think that they're really taking this into perspective because they don't want to lose your energy. They They're trying to keep a positive mindset when it comes to the situation. But I feel like this masculine is really overthinking the situation, which is putting them into a lot of anxiety and a lot of nervousness. And, and frankly, and I feel a lot of anger as well. I, I think that this masculine is really angry at themselves. They're angry, angry at the situation because of how they played this. They feel like they were trying to play the game and they got played. So I really think that this masculine is taking a deep look, a deep, long look. And they know that they have to make steps. And I feel like they're making plans. They're trying to come up with ideas. And I feel like this masculine is going to run out of their ideas. And they're just going to pop up. They're just going to appear out of nowhere. And want to talk to you. Or want to have a question. They may even come in to ask your advice about a situation just to get a perspective on where you're at. So, Divine Feminine, be aware. Divine Feminine, you also need to be aware that this masculine has not been doing the work all the way. They may have been trying to make small steps, small changes, but I feel like this masculine is moving at a turtle's pace. They're not moving very fast. And they've 
done a lot of overthinking the situation and also trying to keep their routine. These masculines have a certain routine that they play. And a lot of times it's just staying in their comfort zone. So when this masculine does come in, or when they do try to communicate with you, be patient and listen, but also be aware that this masculine could still be battling the same addictions, the same um, tendencies that you were dealing with before. You know, um, so be aware that there hasn't been too many changes made. And, you know, and I feel like this masculine is looking for a sign to make their way. There, there are some masculines who are waiting for you to make them first move because they feel like you're not as interested in them as you used to be. They don't feel the same energy that they used to from you. So that, that's making them very nervous. That's making them really feel like it's being over-exaggerated that they're losing you. That's the energy that I'm getting. And I'm getting a lot of fear. I'm getting a lot of fear. And I feel like everything that this masculine is going through, I feel like they may have had some type of health issues very recently. And they're trying to improve on something that they're dealing with. As far as their health, <clears throat> very interesting. But I feel like this, this masculine has been contemplating for a while the reasons why they didn't give your relationship the chance that they should have. And I feel like they're in a lot of regret and a lot of reflecting on the situation and i i think that some of them are having that aha moment like man i was the problem i was the issue i'm the one that messed this up and they're finally coming to that realization that you know you were just trying to show love you were just trying to show gratitude and you know be your beautiful nurturing self and that's what attracted them to you in the first place this masculine could also be dealing with a lot of financial situations at the moment um i feel like there's unexpected bills that they weren't anticipating and i i'm i'm seeing car issues for some it's strictly car issues they they you know some of them are really big on on dealing with their cars you know and for some of them unfortunately you know, their car is a big part of what makes them feel masculine. I feel like Spirit is saying that you're both still in a time of healing. You're both in a time of wake, awakening spiritually. And you, Divine Feminine, being the more spiritual of the two I feel like even though you have done so much healing even though you have put in so much time and effort into the situation spirit is wanting you to be still be still and focus on your life and 
um, moving forward in a way that is increasing your spirituality, your gifts, and also taking action on certain gifts that you've been given during this journey. I feel like Divine Feminine, you are going to come into your purpose way before the Divine Masculine. And you're going to come into your purpose in a way that is going to increase your abundance in a way that you've never even imagined. And when I say abundance, I mean in all the perspectives of abundance, whether that's love, money, happiness, joy, you know, and, and I feel like spirit is really wanting you to focus not to really focus on the masculine or focus on what they're doing where they're going how you know how they're coming on this journey i feel like the masculine um is working at their own pace but they are right where they need to be and if there are masculines who are lagging behind, I feel like they're going to get those unexpected things that are coming into their life that are going to move them forward. Because I feel like, you know, if you don't move when spirit wants you to, there's consequences. And that's going to make you move in the direction that he wants you to go in right so yeah and i feel like this is really a big time for healing for both of you and everything is coming together in perfect timing i know i i know it's hard to keep hearing that divine timing perfect timing it's all aligned and everything is happening just as it should be you're right where you need to be and that just you hear that and it just feels like ah i don't want to hear that anymore i'm i'm just done hearing that but that's letting you know that patience is needed that's something that needs to be worked on because things are happening just as it should be things are going just the way it should everything is playing out just the way it's supposed to you know and think back you know your divine masculine they have courted you in a way that has been so different so different from anything else that you've been through so of course this is not going to go the same way as everything else that you've been through this is going to be totally different this journey is unique this your situation is unique nothing about your situation is going to play out the same way as someone else's it's just not your masculine is a very unique person because you're one soul how can you be unique and they not it's just not possible you're both so similar and yet so different so just have patience and everything will play out the way that it's supposed to Many blessings to you. Love and light.